Okay guys, I just picked up this car a couple days ago. Um, I gotta unload it, the trailer. I already got it unstrapped, just gotta push it down. Um, we are doing a case swap on this car. Um, but we gotta pull everything off underneath the engine bay. This is the one that, on the previous video, you saw me put the engine on the stand. Um, the car was white or silver, but the owner painted it this color, my buddy. Um, then when I was talking to him, I told him, paint the engine bay, got the engine out. So he bought it here. We're gonna weld the mounts on it. So that way when they paint the engine bay, it's already mounted. And I think we're gonna go ahead and try to mount the inner cooler. So that way that part's mounted. Well, we're gonna you know, make the mounts for it and then unbolt the inner cooler again. Uh, it's gonna be boosted. Um, but yeah, let me push this off the trailer and get back on, on this, be right back. All right, well, I just discovered this. See how it's not even welded. And really the only thing holding this thing is that one thing that they're gonna bolt. I mean, once you put the radiator, the, the bumper support, I guess it'll get bolted down, right? But we gotta take care of this before we, you know, before we do anything. Well, we'll I'll continue removing this, but just updating you guys, I found that. I did already let my friend know about it. I'm waiting for his reply to see what's up. But we gotta take care of it. I can't let it leave like that because then it, then it looks bad on me or on us. So one way or the other, I gotta take care of it. But yeah, um, got some stuff off of it. I'm gonna wait till my son gets back for the brakes so that way we can drain, properly drain the reservoir so we don't make too much of a mess. Same thing with the power steering lines and stuff. I know it's already probably leaking, but yeah. Uh, other than that, just little odds and ends. It should be ready after we fix this, but you know, we gotta take care of it. So yeah, uh, be right back. Okay guys, it's been a couple days. Um, we got the engine bay stripped, got the harness tucked away there. I'm hoping they will Tie it somewhere in the middle, tape it, same thing there. We decided we're gonna leave the brake booster on because we can't exactly get underneath the dash because they have some, oh, I guess we could, but we decided we're gonna keep it on because we're not taking it off. Uh, you know, and I don't know. All right, we've got the engine bay all apart. Uh, the harness stuck there. The other side harness is stuck there. Um, I do have to remove the hose. Um, and we just kind of bend this thing down. Probably gonna bend it up again. You know, um, yeah. And if it wasn't for the front end being jacked up, this thing would be on the way to the body shop today, but we gotta take care of this. I mean, even this, probably clean it up um, here let me show you the motor mounts we got it welded um, the lining holes are right there and right there I do it upside down and that's how you know you, this thing is lined up um, and I think normally the, what they want you to do is drill holes and put the long bolt they supplied to go through but I think it's better if we just weld it, you know, and then when they paint it, it'll be painted with the car. Um, it'll be the same color, right? Yeah, so that's put on. Um, yeah, so let's get to this and then we'll be right back. All right, um, I got the car loaded up. I'm gonna end this video right here. Um, we give it a quick weld. I know it's not pretty, but oh, sorry. I know it's not pretty, but it'll hold much better. You know, so now it's it's actually on there. Um, and we help this side a little bit. Um, you know, we really couldn't go too crazy on it because we don't want any splashback because they, like I said, they painted the outside of the car. Uh, and we're undecided what we're going to do in the bottom piece.
right now. We'll get it back and we'll fit the inner cooler on it. For now, it's headed to the body shop so they can paint the engine bay. And as you can see, we welded the engine up. It really was only supposed to come here for that, but we took care of everything else. All right, um, we'll, well, we'll end this video here and next video we'll see this is when we pick it back up probably in a few weeks all right